Hi, and uh, welcome to today's drum tutorial. Today we're going to be taking a look at the song It Is Well With My Soul by Hillsong Chapel. This is on their Forever Rain album, and it's in 4-4 timing. Uh, I want to make sure that you guys know about our website, pursuegod.org slash worship, and it's got a lot of great resources on it that you can check out. They'll help you and your worship team to learn some songs, as well as a lot of other great tutorials. Also, subscribe to our YouTube channel for the latest updates on videos and just uh, other great resources we have coming out. So let's go ahead and start this tutorial. I'm going to play along a little bit and just show you a few different ideas of what you could do on a drum set. This is um, Hillsong Chapel, so it's a little bit softer. They don't actually use a full drum set in the recording. So I'm just going to um, show you what you could do on a drum set with um, this type of a, a softer uh, recording. So. Let's go ahead and jump right in.
So let's go ahead and talk about that real quick. Um, basically, what's really important to note in this song is the snare roll pattern and the hi-hat is very key. If you can attach a tambourine to your hi-hat actually so that when you clasp down on it with the foot pedal, it will actually make that tambourine uh, sound. Um, so that's one great idea, but it, you can also get away with just uh, doing the hi-hat like I'm doing there. So basically, um, that pattern at the end of the song with the bass pedal is it's a snare roll and then it's... So it's basically a pickup. Two E and a three and a four E and a one E and a two E and a three and a four E and a one E and a two E and a three. So that uh, pattern. Da 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 da. It's really important on the bass. It gives it that fluid um, kind of rolling um, but stable kind of feel on the bass. And then the hi hat is going on all fours. I'm simply uh, just keeping like a single stroke roll beat with a few buzz rolls in there. Uh, for most of the song, and you can accent a little bit more with staccato once you get into the bridge. Um, just to make it a little bit more powerful if you choose. Um, same type of beat. At the beginning of the song on the floor toms, very similar structure. Um, it's all about tastefulness. It's all about layering things in. I wouldn't recommend going crazy or even going to a ride cymbal. I mean, you could go to a ride cymbal toward the end. Uh, if you so choose, I don't think dynamically you need to with this song. Um, but if you want to, you can add that. Um, just be careful not to add too much. The song is about simplicity and richness. So see what you can do to add that with your uh, drum set and your um, drum skills with your team uh, playing this song. And thanks so much for checking out this tutorial. We'll see you again soon.